made impure by the hundred-headed snake called Kalia. The monster had been living in the pool with his family for many generations. One day, the gopas and their cattle were near the pool. The cattle were thirsty, so they bent over and drank some water. What is the matter? Why are you crying? My cows are dead. They drank water from the pool. Our cows will not be safe as long as Kalia lives. Krishna, where are you going? Krishna jumped into the pool. Kalia was surprised and angry to see that someone had actually disturbed his privacy. He attacked Krishna and stung him with his fangs. He wrapped himself around Krishna's tender body in order to kill him. How dare you enter my waters? I'm surprised that the poison didn't get to you first. Ha! Huh. Now you shall see your end. where I will protect you. Kalia followed Krishna's orders. The Yamuna River was pure and sweet again. Krishna emerged from the river with the rare gems and jewels that Kalia's wife had given to him. The people were 